Hi everyone, good evening, welcome, nice to have you here. How are you today, Katia? Good. Good. Are you feeling Six. tired? Hi, teacher. Hi, Maricela. Welcome. A little bit. It's Friday. So sometimes Fridays are difficult, right? Do you work Six. tomorrow? Six. Mañana aún todavía. Oh. Yes. Okay. Who else works on, on Saturday? Todos ustedes trabajan en, en Saturday. Jenny, también. Maricela. Les toca trabajar sa uh, Saturdays. Yes. No, Mirna. Sí. Sí. Ah, ok. But just half of the day. Me imagino que solo la mitad del día. Sí. Ah, ok. Ok, so it's better. Ajá, so... Uh -huh. so so, which is the, the most difficult day for you? ¿Qué día se sienten más cansados? Which is your most difficult day? Viernes. Friday. Nadie mira en you. Friday. Monday. Lunes. Ah, Monday. okay. In your case, Mondays. And you, Katia? Mondays. Mondays, too. Okay. Sí. And me as Thursdays. Why Thursday, Nehemiah? Why on Thursdays? ¿Por qué los, los jueves en su casa? You have a lot of activities at work. Por el trabajo, que ya se está agotando la semana y aún mm -hmm. a veces se quedan pendientes. Ah, okay. And do you work Saturdays? Usted también trabaja los sábados. No, no, no trabajo. No. Ah, ok, so today is the last day. Ya hoy fue el último. Sí. Ok, all right, yeah. well, yes, today we finish the first week. Ahora se acaba ya la primera semana, right? Ya pasó una semana, time flies. Ok, so we will have some activities. You're going to speak a lot. And we will review, we will review what we have been studying. Today is like a, a review day. We will refresh everything that we have studied. Um, guys, I'm going to take the attendance. I'm going to take the attendance. So <clears throat> please remember to say present. Okay, so Alexander Mejia. No. Ana Funes. Present. Thank you. Doris, Doris, okay, Iris, Jenny, Jennifer, present, thank you, Jose Castro, Adonai, present, okay, thank you, Adonai, Mario Cruz, Present. Katia. Present. Thank you. Manuel Hidalgo. No. Angela de Jimenez. No. Maria Mejia. No. Maricela. Present. Thank you. Mauricio. No. Mirna. Present. Thank you, Minette. Nehemias. Present. Nelson. Vladimir. Presente. Thank you. And Janira. Okay, Janira is not here. Okay, so let's let's start the review. Let me see. Mirna. Can you please say the alphabet, Mirna? The alphabet. What, what is the alphabet? A, B, C, D, E, okay. F, G. Give me A. one moment. I'm going to put it here. A, B, C. Uh -huh. C, B, B, E, F, G, H, 
I G H Ajá G H I G K L M G J K L M Okay, let's ask for help. Good oh. job. I'm going to stop you, Mirna, but great. Mm -hmm. You know the, the first, well, everything. Jennifer, can you continue? Continue with the last letters of the alphabet. M. N. N. O. Mm -hmm. T. Mm -hmm. U. R. S. Mm -hmm. T. U. Uh -huh. V. W. W. X. Y. Mm -hmm. Z. Z, yes. Okay, thank you. So here we have the alphabet. We, we learned the alphabet this week, right? Now, do you like the beach? Do you like to go to the beach, guys? Do you go there often? No. A little bit. Okay. Well, we are going to imagine that we are going to the beach. Okay, we are going to imagine or think that we are going to the beach. Vamos a ir a la playa ahorita. So, I'm going to type something here. We have to say this, I'm going to the beach and I'm bringing and then you have to say something with the letter of the alphabet, okay? I'm going to repeat. We have to say this script, this sentence you see here. Then you have to mention something that you are taking or uh -huh, that you're taking to the beach. And Maricela, let me see if I can, if I can refresh it. And now, Maricela, can you can you see it? Yes, yes. Ah, okay, okay, great. Um, okay, so the idea is that we have to think about something that we can get to the beach with in an alphabetical order. I'm going to explain. Vamos a decir este script, esta oración que está acá, y luego tenemos que decir algo que vamos a llevar a la playa con la letra del alfabeto. Vamos a ir en orden alfabetical. Así que si yo comienzo, yo empiezo con letter A. Y si Katia sigue, ella va a continuar con letter B. Y así, progresivamente. Pero tienen que mencionar lo que las personas anteriormente han dicho. Por ejemplo, si yo digo, I'm going to the beach and I'm bringing apples, Katia tendría que decir, I'm going to the beach and I'm bringing apples and what else? Orange. With B. With B. You have to say something Banana. with B. Uh -huh. Bananas. Entonces hay que ir repitiendo, ¿ok? You understand? En no notes, ¿ok? No notes. Your hands up. Con las manos arriba ahora. Hoy todo con la memoria, ¿ok? It's a memory game. And I can see you. Ok, so uh, Mirna and Ana, if you can activate the camera, I will appreciate it. Ok, so ready? Yes. Ok, so let me see Mario. Ok, Mario, you are the first one. Remember to say this. And then you start with letter A. Sería de A. Empezaría uh -huh. con A. Yes. 
and 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 repeat this. Depende de lo que voy a llevar. Ah, okay. You're going to the beach right now. You have to imagine that you are taking everything to the beach. With A, con la letra A. Puede ser una persona también. Ah, yes, yes, you can do that. Okay. Ready? I'm going. It will be anything. Uh -huh. I, I'm going to the beach mm -hmm. and I bring Anna. Okay, all right. So thank you. <laughs> Katia, continue. <laughs> But remember, you have to uh, say Anna, right? And then you continue. Okay. I'm going to the beach, uh, mm -hmm. and I'm bring, bringing bringing mm -hmm. Anna, Anna and balls. <laughs> balls. Yes, that's a good idea. We play soccer, right, in the beach. Okay. Continue, Vladimir. And remember, don't take notes, only here. Okay, Vladimir. Okay, I go into the beach and I'm bringing Anna, balls and cups. And cups, like tazas, cups. Yes. Okay, cups. yes. To drink coffee, right? Uh-huh, okay, yes. thank you. Jenny, continue, please. You're next. I'm going to the beach mm -hmm. and I'm bringing Anna, balls, mm -hmm. cups, and dress. A dress. Mm, okay. A dress. All right. That's okay. All right. Thank you. Continue, Anna. Uh, uh -huh. este... You have to take yourself. Usted se va a llevar a usted misma. But yes, you have to say it. <laughs> okay, Anna, go. I'm going mm -hmm. to the beach mm -hmm. and I bring in. Bring in. Mm -hmm. I. Start with this one. I'm bringing Anna. Anna. Uh huh. This balls. Balls. Mm -hmm. With letter C. Do you remember? Se acuerda, Ana? No. No. Okay, no problem. Who can help Ana? Who could help Ana to continue? Well, let me see. Um, can you, Adonai? Can you continue? <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. Start from here. No sé qué, dijo. ¿Qué dijo Jennifer? Perdón. Uh, Jennifer said, uh, let me see. Dress. Ajá, dress. Dress. Yes. A dress. Mm -hmm. But start from here, from, from letter A. Ah, okay. I'm going to the beach and mm -hmm. I'm bringing. Anna, mm -hmm. balls, cups, and a dress. Mm -hmm. And now with letter E. Um, and uh, elephant. Mm, wow. Okay. <laughs> Good imagination, Adonai. Thank you, Nehemias. Continue. Continue, please. I am going to the beach. And mm -hmm. I am bringing Anna, balls, cups, dresses, 
elephant and firefly. And fireflies. Okay, Nemias, good. Let's see. Mm, let me check. Iris, can you continue? Hi, Iris. Good evening. Um, I don't hear you, Iris. <laughs> we have problems with the microphone. No. No, not yet. You have to shake it. Quizás tienes que moverlo un poquito. No. No. Okay, don't worry. We will try it later. Okay, so last one, Maricela, can you continue? Uh, just, okay, go ahead. Serial. Uh, hey. Um, yes. I, 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 I am going mm -hmm. to be to the beach. To the beach. Uh huh. And I am bringing, bringing, bringing. Yes. Anna. Mm hmm. Bob. Mm hmm. Cut. Cut. Dress. Cut. Dre dress. Mm hmm. Elephant. Mm hmm. Fire, firefly, e with G. Cat. Mm -hmm. No, another one. No, cat is concert. Yes, correct. You have to choose another one. Ay, se me ha escapado la palabra con G. Uh, okay. And you guys, can you help? Can you help, um, Maricela? Ah, uh, it is, puede ser girls? Girls, yeah, some girlfriends, right? Friends, that's a good idea. Okay, thank you, Maricela, good job. It was just to exercise our memory, a memory game. Hi, Doris, welcome, nice to have you here. And Iris, did you fix the problem? Hoy sí, ya, ya está bien el, el microphone. Hi. Hi, Doris. No, I don't hear you, Iris. Maybe later, maybe it works later. If not, we can use the chat. Si no, con el chat vamos a, a trabajar. Okay, so guys, as I told you before, today we're going to refresh. Okay, we're going to refresh what we have been studying. Today is a, a review day. I'm going to share the book. We're going to start by working in the Okay, it's page 17, page number 17, let me check, yes. Go to page 17, we are going to work in groups. We're going to work in groups of four and we're going to do this. I'm going to explain a little bit and then we will we will divide uh, to do it. Okay, so part number one, you and your group are going to ask each other the name. You have to ask his or her name in English, like Adonai. Well, no, I cannot say Adonai, right? Like, um, what is your name? And you tell her, no puedo decir Adonai, what is your name? ¿Por qué? <laughs> porque ya lo estoy diciendo, pero el punto es que pregunten el nombre de cada quien. Okay, so you can ask, what is your name? And the occupation. Uh -huh. And what is your occupation? I am a teacher. My name is Evelyn. Okay, you ask each other. Vamos a preguntarnos todos esas, esas dos preguntas. Okay, part number two, in groups, we're going to correct the sentences, okay? We have to look for the mistake and correct the sentence. For example, number one, we am marketing managers. Do you see the mistake? Ven allí el error, lo que hay que corregir. Can you see it? Sería R. 
Ajá. Entonces, como grupo, lo van a ir arreglando. Ok, you're going to fix the sentences. And then, in the last part, part number four, you have to elaborate four, four or six questions with the verb be and ask your questions to your classmates. En la última parte tienen que elaborar individualmente una pregunta y luego se van a preguntar, valga la redundancia, sus preguntas. For example, Katia. Katia crea cuatro preguntas, se las pregunta a sus tres compañeros. Nehemías, are you happy? Or Nehemías, are you a manager? Y ya tomamos notas, ¿ok? Entonces nos vamos a preguntar todos. Do you have a question about the activity? Do you have a, a question about the, the activity, guys? En la última parte sería cada uno crea sus preguntas. Ajá. Uh -huh. okay. Yes. Individually, and then you ask. You ask the questions to your classmates. Okay, we're going to work in groups, and, and I'm going to visit the groups, okay, to help you. Okay, let me let me create the rooms. Um, okay. So let's see. Anna. Okay, Anna, you're going to work with with Katia. Katia and Maricela. Okay. And then we will have in the next group, Doris, Iris, and Minette. How is your, your microphone, Iris? Ya, ya está mejor. Yes. Ah, okay. All right, perfect. Ah, pues van a poder ahí comunicarse. Okay, in the next group, we will have Jenny, Adonai, and Mario. And in the last group, we will have Mirna, Nehemias, and Vladimir, okay? Please open the invitation and I'm going to visit you, visit you over there. Uh, hola, Flor, está ahí. Ah, Ay, sí, hola. Sí, Hi, good evening. <risa> no sé. Acá estoy acompañándole. Ah, sí, sí, gracias. Le iba a solicitar, Pero... gracias a usted Ajá. por el acceso. Le iba a solicitar si me puede ubicar en una de las salas para Ajá. observar la actividad. Sí, eso quería preguntarle que cómo hacíamos acá. Solo que no sé si le tengo que dar como, como el, el host o la mando a un grupo. Exacto, oh, solo mandé mi grupo. Solo la envío. Ajá. Ah, bye. Sí, sí, sí. A cualquiera, sí. ¿verdad? Ok. Así a cualquiera. Muy amable, gracias. Uh -huh. Ok, you're welcome. ¿Y quién le puso ese nombre, mi niña? <risa> Hi. My, my part. You're talking about your name. Están hablando del nombre de Minet. Sí, sí. Yo también tenía esa pregunta. Yo le iba a preguntar cuando supe el nombre, pero me dio pena. Pero ya que Doris preguntó. Ajá. Pues, hay mis papás que, que se inventaron los nombres. Pero, pero se oye nombre, como... Ese... Como el, es Rusia. elegante, ajá, como que fuera de la realeza. No sé, quizás porque he visto la película del diario de la princesa y, y así se llama la, la protagonista, Minet. Minet, no, ese es el segundo. Ah. Termópolis, sí. ajá, pero está bien. Es que sí. Sí. Uso, sí, ¿verdad? Es, sí, es que decía, bueno, a mí no me consta, ¿verdad? lo que no me consta no puedo asegurar. Decía mi papá que él tenía descendencia rusa, porque es curioso, porque lo, todos los hijos que él tiene, tienen nombres extraños. 
a excepción de dos. Porque, por ejemplo, mi hermano, el mayor, él se llama Clay Daikoski y Joseph Anthony. Solo el primer nombre <risa> tiene 15 letras. ¡Guau! Wow, interesante. Y, y luego mi otra hermana, ella se llama Miri Lacey Libanoski. Ah, si me preguntan, yo no puedo escribir el nombre de ninguno de mis hermanas. Qué interesante. Y ya la pequeña como que ya dijeron, no, ya le vamos a bajar un poquito. Yeah, Entonces bueno. ya la pequeñita ya tiene un nombre más latino. Se llama Fátima Marían Lareisi. Ah. Entonces ya ella ya le combinaron un poquito el nombre. El wow. Latino con... con otro extranjero, pero en ese tiempo quizás todavía asentaban en la alcaldía, ¿verdad? Los nombres todavía, extranjeros. aunque fíjese que imagínese, yo no sé cómo realmente hizo, porque la ley entró en, el, entró en vigencia en el 92, que ya pedía que fueran nombres en castellano. Entonces, y yo soy del 93, y mi hermana la pequeñita es del 2003. Entonces, todavía pude escribir, no sé de qué forma. Ok, sorry, Pero... before I go, because I have to check the other groups. Do you need help? Do you have some doubts? Mm -hmm. ¿Tienen algunas dudas o preguntas antes que me marche? Mm -hmm. De no. momento, creo que no. Eh, bueno, en la, en la cuarta parte solo es hacer preguntas, ¿verdad? Ajá, utilizando a el pose, ¿sí? No. no. Solo, sí puedes utilizarlo, sí podrías, pero aquí te da como el comienzo, the, the start. Ya trae que deberían de utilizar al Ajá. principio. Is, are, am, is, are. Así que no sé por el tiempo si van a lograr hacer seis, ¿verdad? Pero el objetivo es que practiquen speaking en, en estas activities, mm. como pueden ver. Solo hay una que es de arreglar la oración de grammar, pero de ahí pueden practicar un poquito. Igual vamos a seguir practicando, ¿verdad? Pero sí, la, el objetivo es que tú hagas unas cinco preguntas y se las preguntes a Iris en Doris. Mm. Y luego tomas notas. Doris is Ay, o Doris, she isn't, ¿verdad? Ahí respondes la pregunta. Y luego va Iris y ustedes solo contestan. Uh -huh. mm. Eso ok. Eso muy bien. Ok. Teacher. Este, y, y la, para preguntar la ocupación sería what's your occupation yes what is your occupation o puede what ser is... la contraction what's what's your occupation what? mm -hmm. what's yes. your name ajá yes y ahí está el, okay. el positive de your verdad de tu ocupación your occupation mm -hmm. Okay. Gracias. In that case, I'm going to let you continue. See you in a moment. Bye. Hello. No sé si. Hola. How are you? How can I help you, Katia, Marisela, Ana? Do you need help? Hello. Estábamos empezando eh, el primer ejercicio de la página 18. Uh, this one. Yeah, ah. mistakes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. So you. Empezando lo yo. You already finished this part. Okay. Sí. Okay, cool. And is there something I can help you with? Do you have some questions in this moment? Uh, sí, yo tengo una. Mm -hmm. Si solo vamos a, a subrayar el, el error, ¿verdad? O encerrarlo en un círculo. En tenemos que Tenemos que corregirlo. Ajá. Uh -huh. The instruction says that you have to rewrite the correct sentence. You have to write it in the correct way. That is what you okay. should do. Mm -hmm. uh, ok. Ok. So, any other questions? Maricela or Ana? And this part here, we're, um, we're good. Esa, esa parte sí sería individual, perdón. Uh -huh. You have to take some time, elaborate the questions, and then you ask. For example, if I finish, I ask Maricela. 
I ask you, Katia, I ask Anna, and I write the answers. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And in a few minutes, we are going to go back to the main room and we will check, we will check the information a little bit. Uh-huh. Okay. Okay. Okay, well, in that case, I'm going to let you continue and I'm going to visit another room, okay? See you in, in a moment, goodbye. Are you, are you, a Vladimir, are you consa, co, a consa, a consa, a consa, a consa, a consa, entonces sería el compañero me dice, no, verdad, no, I am not, o, oh. it's not, <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just checking on you, but I can see that you're doing well, right? Or do you have some, some questions? Is there something I can help you with? Ah, oh, ok, ok. So you're good. Ok. Ustedes saben que siempre los vengo a, a ver un ratito. Así que, pero me delata el, el Zoom, ¿verdad? Que siempre le aviso. No puedo venir así, así no silenciosamente. Más, Ajá, okay. sí, como un fantasma no puedo. Siempre tengo que anunciarlo. Ok, entonces estamos bien por acá. Otro ratito sí. quizás vengo solo a escucharlos un poco cuando ya estén haciendo preguntas. Okay. ok, ok. Aquí si ustedes pueden ver ya les da el inicio de su pregunta. Ya tienen, tienen que tomar en cuenta que tienen que empezar con R, con is o con M. Entonces tomen eso en cuenta que ya está una parte de ella. Okay. Okay. Well, I'm going to continue. Goodbye. Okay. Hi. How are you? Are you in the last part of the activity? Yes. You are making the questions, yes. I imagine. Esas preguntas de las últimas. Uh -huh. ¿Las vamos a formular nosotras para pre nosotros para preguntarlos entre nosotros o, uh -huh. o nosotros vamos a formular? Mm, here. Esas son para preguntarlas acá entre ustedes y, y tomar notas. Ajá. Uh -huh. Y yo voy a estar eh, viniendo a escucharlos Ajá, en unos minutos solo cómo se preguntan y cómo responden. En el otro room vamos a más que todo a, a chequear la primera parte. La, la primera parte de, de lo que se mencionaron sus occupations y vamos a chequear la parte de, de corregir, pero esta no, esta solo yo acá la voy a, a escuchar, pero todavía les falta un poquito, ¿verdad? Quizás regreso en unos minutitos. Ajá, sí. ok. Um, ok, so in that case I'm going to go. Ok, I'll visit you in, in another moment. Okay. okay, one moment. Goodbye. Hi, you are in the last part. Hola. Ya van en la última parte. Por sí. la cinco, la última. Ah, okay, okay. So. Alrededor de las 8.40 vamos a, a volver al, al main room. Eh, okay. Para que lo consideren, ajá. Y traten de, por lo menos, <ríe> okay. hacer unas tres preguntas cada uno, ¿verdad? Para que practiquen todos. Ok. And you, Ana, okay. you need help. Ana, ¿qué tal va? ¿Necesita ayuda? Bien. No, ahorita no. Gracias. Ok. All right. So I'm going to... Continue checking, okay? Goodbye. Okay. Entonces tendría, ay Dios mío, tendría que decir este, her, ¿verdad? Her is. Podemos no. suponer la de, de ella. Lo podemos poner como her. 
Y, y Aren sería Isen. <risa> um, can I help you, Doris? Es que está... ¿Hay algo en el que les vale. puede ayudar? Sí, estamos en la, en la cinco. Number five, ¿de qué parte? Sí, de, de la tres. Ajá. Ok, here. Esa. Uh -huh. Which is the, the mistake? What could be the change? O sea, eh, number five de mm -hmm. exercise three, mm -hmm. eh, the secretary Arendt, Arendt, Laura Miranda. Mm -hmm. Entonces, entonces cre, creemos que está hablando de la secret que no es la secretaria de Laura Miranda. Ella no es la secretaria. Entonces, ahí estamos un poco confundidas, pero estábamos dejando en vez de Dale, her. Y en vez de mm. Aren y... Mm. No. Yes. O sea, una parte sí está bien. 50 um, Ajá, ese es el, el único mistake. Porque están hablando de una secretaria que es de varias personas. Entonces es there. Their secretary mm -hmm. isn't, isn't. Pero es una sola mujer. Ajá. Isn't Laura Miranda. Es la secretaria o sea, de ellos. Uh -huh. O sea, la secretaria. Ella, ella no es la secretaria de ellos. Uh -huh. ¿Cómo es la cosa? Uh -huh. Algo así. así. Ajá. Entonces, está hablando de esta posesión. La posesión es la secretaria, pero es una posesión de varias personas. Como que usted, uh -huh. su esposo, yo tuviéramos la misma persona como secretaria. Uh -huh. Ajá, entonces tenemos que usar there, ¿verdad? Porque hay tres personas. Sí. Pero ya acá, como solo es una persona, entonces ya es isn't. Ah, es... O sea, la secretaria de ellos no es Laura Miranda. Ajá, ajá. Like that. Mm. Ok, thank you. Ajá, you're welcome. Thank you. Ok, so I'm going to continue, but I was just checking on you, so... I'll see you in, in a few minutes, okay? Mm -hmm. Otro sería. Hola. Hi. I'm, I'm here just Bye. listening to you. <laughs> ya, ya vamos. Yes, you are asking, you're asking the questions. Hola. Hello. En la, en el número one, yo le puse R. Juan en posture. Entonces la respuesta sería yes, they are in the chore. O solo yes, they are. ¿Cómo? Repita la pregunta. Uh -huh. <ríe> Como que no le, no le entendí, disculpe. Es que el, el Wi-Fi, Marisela, the connection, the connection is not good. Is, sí, is not stable. Está fallando. Uh -huh. So that's why it's a little bit difficult. Ok, um, en el, Katia... En el chat, uh -huh. Ah, that's a good idea. Okay, Katia, can you say your questions? I want to listen to the, the questions that you created. Okay, este sería, are you a police officer? Mm -hmm. Y ahí tengo una duda en la respuesta, pero le puse, mm -hmm. no, we aren't. Uh, we are. You, you aren't. Pero, 
o sería Ajá. porque dice are are you verdad uh -huh. le puse are. no sé si está correcto si referirse oh. a él como si fueran varios policías ah ok but in that case uh -huh. you have to say they they si son varios uh -huh. Ajá. entonces sería no they mm. aren't Aunque sí. si fueran varios, se utilizaría are they, are they? No, entonces sí sería no. Are you a police officer? Podría ser si me preguntas a mí, si yo lo soy, yo diría no, I'm mm -hmm. not. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. Uh -huh. Okay, entonces la, me confundí ahí, pero okay, no eh, la siguiente sería uh, is is she your sister? Uh -huh. Y si y estás sería, preguntándole a tus compañeras. Eh, no es que no no habíamos terminado nosotros ah, de, okay. de hacerlas. Ah, okay. No no Ajá. la podemos. Ajá, porque estábamos haciéndola. Ajá, ah, okay. ok. Ok, pero ahorita todavía tienen tiempo. Puedes preguntarles esas preguntas a tus compañeras. Porque por eso okay. todavía no he cerrado los rooms, porque casi todos van aquí. Entonces, estamos dando un poquito más oh, de tiempo. Okay. Ajá, so you still have some time, ok? You can continue. Oh, ok. Ok. camino. Okay. Okay. Cuidado, la migra. De... Oh my God. So, how are you doing? Okay. Did you finish? Hoy sí, ya. Yeah. Ya termin terminamos una serie de. Bueno, los primeros ejercicios, pero queremos incluir más preguntas. Ajá, lo hemos okay. hecho tres en la primera parte, una por cada uno. Ajá. Había que hacer más. En la primera parte. Ah, Ajá. era. De, 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 de. Mm, no, that would be enough. Pero bueno, si ya terminaron. Ajá, en in, in about two minutes we will go back. Voy a ir a, a, a chequear un room. Ah, sí, yo creo que ya en unos dos minutos ya vamos a juntarnos. Okay, so ah, yes, if, okay. if you can practice a little bit more, continue, okay? If you can continue okay. asking questions in English, practice. Okay, okay. so I'll see you in a moment. <laughs> Bye. Or, no, she isn't. Hi, continue, continue. I, I'm just listening to you. Okay. Is she the new boss? No, she is the, the new bus. Okay. Mario. Eh, la verdad no entendí la pregunta. Te voy a ser sincero. No. Um, no la repetí, por favor. Is she the new bus? Uh, yes, she. No. No, también. She. <laughs> no, she isn't. She isn't. No, she isn't. <laughs> Your dog. Okay. <laughs> is visiting <laughs> you. <laughs> Are they partners? Are they partners? Barber. Partners. Um, send it in the chat. Ah, uh, okay. That's the one, right? Do you yes. know that yes. word? Partners is like co-workers. Yes, they are. Mm -hmm. 
como compañeros. Compañero. Uh -huh. Yes, they are. Uh -huh. okay. Yes, they are. They are. Okay, continue. In one minute, we will we will go back to the other room. Okay, but you you still have a few seconds. Hello, welcome back. Okay, so I hope you have some time to practice, right? Now we will check, we will check a little bit your answers. We will start with this one. Um, I'm going to choose to some of you to read this information. Okay, so Iris, can you tell me Doris and Minette's occupations? Your notes about them. I, um, it is, uh -huh. it is, is going to say your occupation and Minette's occupation. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay. Yes. Perdón. Doris is a coordinator. Uh -huh. And Minette? Minette is a business Ejecutiva de negocio, business ex, executive. Executive. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, thank you, Iris. Okay, Doris, can you tell us about Iris and Iris occupation? Iris, she, she is a buyer. Ah? She is buyer. A buyer. Remember, we, we need the a. A buyer. Okay. She is a buyer. Buyer, like compradora. That is what you that what you mean, it is. Compradora. Like a merchant. Uh, no. Del área de compras, compradora. Ah, okay, okay. <laughs> so, sounds good. Thank you. Let's, let's check the trabajo. next one. <laughs> let's check the next one. Uh, Ana, Katia, and Maricela. Okay, Ana, can you tell us Katia's and Maricela's occupation? Maricela is secretary. Mm -hmm. Katia is assistant. And assistant. Assistant. Uh -huh. Hay que recordar que hay que poner una A antes de la occupation. Okay, Ana, thank you. And now, Katia, can you tell us Ana's occupation, please? Uh, Ana sería a nurse. Is a? Is nurse. a nurse. Yes, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. that's... That's correct. Okay, thank you. Group number three, Jennifer, Jose, Adonai, and Mario. Okay, Mario, can you tell us Adonai's and Jennifer's occupation? The microphone, Mario. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Yes. Adonai. Mm -hmm. He is a tighter's, tighter's supervisor. Uh -huh. Jennifer, she is a cashier. Cashier. Mm -hmm. Cashier. Okay, Mario, thank you. And then, Jenny, can you tell us Mario's occupation? It's a uh, development assistant. Development assistant. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you, Jenny. Then Mirna, Nehemias, and Vladimir. Okay, so Mirna, can you tell us Nehemias and Vladimir's occupation? Nehemias Sandoval and a consultant. Is? Uh -huh. An account. Nemias is an account. Mm -hmm. uh, 
Vladimir Roas is a coordinator. Mm -hmm. Ah, yes. Ah, yes. How? <laughs> is that like the abbreviation? Or what, what does it mean? Coordinator where? Co coordinator. Ah, yes. Is that I S? Uh, coordinator exterior agent. Ah, okay. Ah, okay. External, external agent. <laughs> eh, agente es la última palabra, ¿verdad? Sí. Ah, ok. Ese, Agen agencia. Ese, agencia. Ah, ok. Agencies. Agencies. Hey. Agencies. Ok, Mirna. Thank you. En Nehemías, can you tell us Mirna's occupation, please? Mirna Herrera is a coordinator uh, mm -hmm. RH. En In HR, de recursos humanos. No. Yes. yes. Ah, okay. Yes. HR. 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 Yes. Okay. Thank you. Let's continue with the next part. Let's check this this part. We will start with with Vladimir. Okay. Number one, Vladimir. Can you tell us the correct the mistake and the correction? Uh, okay. Uh, we are marketing managers. Mm -hmm. That's the mistake. We are marketing managers. That's correct. Okay, thank you. Let's continue with Adonai, number two. Can you tell us the correct way to say it? Is she isn't Margarita Marroquin. Uh -huh. She isn't correct that is the the mistake thank you she isn't then we continue with doris okay doris number three okay natalia and sarai is the new supervisor mm -hmm. uh, is Sería R. Ajá, because we have two people. R, yes. Good job. Thank you. Okay, then we go with number four. Let's continue with Mirna. Number four, Mirna. My boss mm -hmm. is Jorge Sandoval. Is, yes. That's the, the correct way to say it. And then the last one, can you help us please, Katia? Sería, their secretary isn't Laura Miranda. Isn't, yes, that's the correct one. Okay, do you have a question about these, these corrections? Questions? No, no questions. No. Okay. Okay, one moment. Okay, so let's continue. We are going to refresh or check different um, information about what we have been studying. I'm going to share with you this presentation, okay? This is the first presentation I share with you. We're going to refresh really quick. The verb be. We have three forms of the verb be. Can you tell us those forms, Adonai? The three forms that we have of the verb be. I am. Mm -hmm. You are. Mm -hmm. He is. Uh -huh. Those are the three forms, right? M, E, and, and R. So here we have 
the subject and the verb. Aquí ten, tienen para recordar cuando ocupamos I am, ¿verdad? O am, cuando ocupamos are y cuando usamos is. Okay, so there we have that info. Can you read it, Iris, please? Can you, can you read it, please? I am, you are, he is, she is, it is, we are, they are. Uh -huh, okay, thank you. And here we have the use to remember when we have to use. Aquí estaba cuando lo utilizábamos. Okay, could you read that one, Vladimir, please? The use of the verb be. Eh, lo siento, teacher, tenía una, una ah, llamada. Ah, okay. Ah, okay. No. Sorry. And no, are no. you are you still busy? Todavía está ocupado. No, ya no, ya no, ya no. Ah, sí. okay. Can you please read Perdón. the the use of the verb be. Eh, veamos. These four points. Ah, eh, mm -hmm. with a description, un adjetivo. An adjective. De localizas. Okay. De localización. Location. Ajá. Uh -huh. eh, no sé. Age. Ajá. Uh -huh. Age. Ajá. Uh -huh. Okay, age, and the last one uh, is. Do you remember uh, with what age? With obligation with age, uh, the subject for time. It is. Uh -huh. is it. Perfect. So this is for you to remember. This is when we have to use the verb be. And now, here we have the negative form. How to make the negative form of the verb be. I am not. You are not. Uh -huh. He is not. This is the negative form. She is not. It is not. We are not not they are not that is the negative form of the verb be. is there something you you would like to to ask is there something you would like to ask about the form of the verb be? algo que quisieran preguntar sobre la forma del verb be? no not in this moment um, okay, I'm going to take, I'm going to take the attendance again. So, Alexander Mejia? No, okay. Ana? Present. Ana okay, thank you. Present. Doris? Okay, Iris? Present. Jennifer? Present. Adonai? Present. Mm -hmm. Mario? Present. Mm -hmm. Jose Castro? No, Jose Castro. Katia? Present. Present. Mm -hmm. Manuel? <laughs> Manuel Hidalgo? María Ángela de Jiménez, María Mejía, Marisela, present, okay. Mauricio, no, okay. Mirna, present, thank you, Minet, present, Nehemías, present, Nelson, Vladimir, Present. And Janira. Okay, all right, so let's continue. Now, questions. We are going to check questions. So if you remember, we check this, this presentation. Um, okay, one moment. We check. In this presentation, we check how to make questions. And here you can see what we have to do. When you ask a question, what do we do, Katia? Do you remember? ¿Qué es lo que hacemos cuando es una, una pregunta? Uh, se 
pone al revés, no sé cómo, se me olvidó cómo se llama. El subject. Pero se invierte, ah, se invierte. Ajá, correct. You change the position of the verb be and the subject, correct. Here you have some examples. Am I your best friend? And this is the answer. Yes, you are. And in this side, you have other questions. Can you read them, Maricela? The examples. Uh, number one, are you Carlos? Mm -hmm. Yes, I am. Next, is she a manager? Yes, she is. Mm -hmm. uh, is he super supervisor? Mm -hmm. No, she isn't. Mm -hmm. No, he isn't. Yes. Mm -hmm. Are you co co colleagues? Co colega, this is co yes. Uh -huh. Colleagues. Colleagues. Are you colleagues? No, we, no, we aren't. No, we aren't. Uh -huh. So here you have, oh, and these ones, Maricela, please. Um, is she a manager? Mm -hmm. Yes, she is. Mm -hmm. No, she isn't. And no, she is not. Uh -huh. It's the same. And the one there. Uh, other are, are you boss here? Bosses here? Yes, they are. Mm -hmm. No, they aren't. No, they are not. Ajá, ok, thank you. So, guys, remember, this is a review. Recuerden que ahorita estamos repasando, ¿verdad? O recordando lo que ya hemos visto. Si ustedes tienen una pregunta o algo que, que cuando vimos este tema no lo entendieron o algo que se les ha olvidado, ahorita, pues, podemos repasarlo. So, questions. ¿Hay algo sobre las preguntas que no se les haya quedado mucho o no recuerden bien? Questions? La palabra es a voces. Voces, ¿cómo se pronuncia? Voces. Voces, ok. Mm -hmm. So, questions about that? No. Ok, the last topic. We will refresh how to use possessives, right? Yesterday we talked about possessive adjectives and, and possessive nouns. So, let's take a look to, to that presentation. Really really quick. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, I'm just going to open it. I thought I had it open. Okay, so in the meantime, possessive adjectives. Nehemias, do you remember them? Possessive adjectives. ¿Se recuerda cuáles eran esos? Possessive adjectives. Because we have possessive nouns. Okay. Um, I'm going to help you a little. Your, my, mm -hmm. your, your, mm -hmm. is, her, our, Ajá. Uh -huh. There and it. Okay, yes. Thank you. So that is what we what we studied yesterday, right? And here we have the, the info about how to use it. Y aquí estaba de, de cómo era que se utilizaban los positive adjectives. Okay, we, we use them before the possession. We use them before the possession. Okay, so Minet, can you give us some examples? Podrías darnos algún ejemplo? Using something that you have? Using my or your, his, her? Um, her name is Anna. Aha, uh -huh, correct. That's a good example. Another one, Mario. Mm -hmm. 
using my or your, his, her. Um, just remember to activate the, the microphone. Okay, there you go. Can you give us one example? <laughs> Using one of those? Or you don't have one in mind? I might. I might. Uh -huh. but. Okay, I'm, I'm going to help you a little bit. Remember, we have, this is the possession. This is the possession. And to express the possession, I use one of those possessive adjectives. My ball or my cell phone. You have to mention the possessive and later we mention the possession that, that we have. Can you guys give me other examples? Do you have some examples in mind? Alguien tiene otros ejemplos? Showing something? Just to refresh really quick. Mm. Uh, Doris, uh -huh. eh, ma, eh, His uh -huh. His pencil uh -huh. is, is Anna. Um, only the possession. His. His. Uh -huh. His pencil. O sea, este lápiz es. Ah, ese sería con el otro, con el otro, uh, con el otro, sí, la es. otra forma que vimos, la de, la de possessive nouns, que ya sería, that is Anna's, Anna's pen, con la S, el que mm -hmm. vimos de último ayer, pero sí, estos que estamos foto. viendo acá, ajá, solo se menciona his or her, y luego la possession. ¿Verdad? Porque en sí. estos ya sabemos de quién estamos hablando, por decirlo así. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. Entonces ¿Sí? sería his, his pencil ¿Eh? is in, uh -huh. in, in the sí. house, in the beach, like ah. this. His house is in the beach, in the as an example. Uh -huh. uh, uh, his, his pencil in, in the house. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that could be one. Mm -hmm. Okay, all right, thank you. This is the last one, the last thing that we study. Si ¿Sí se recuerdan estos? Estos fueron los últimos que vimos el día de ayer, ¿verdad? Cuando usábamos nombres de personas o el título de ellos para hablar de la posesión. And I, I gave you some examples. And remember that we use the apostrophe and the S, ¿verdad? Para dar, dar como esa, esa posesión in English, teníamos que utilizar la S. The apostrophe and the S. The nurse's money is in her house or my dad's car is in the garage. Creo que estos fueron quizás los temas más difíciles de, de la semana, los más confusos. Y pues ya casi solo terminamos un poquito más y vamos a tener una actividad para practicar esto. Pero antes que practiquemos, no sé si quieren que explique algo en específico, porque no lo estoy explicando mucho, porque, porque es un, un refresh, un reminder. But is there a question in specific? ¿Alguna pregunta en específico sobre algo de todo eso? Uh, yo tengo una. ¿Ah? 
es, es sobre eh, el error que tuve de, de you, you are, ¿verdad? O, ah, no de si, Ajá, sí. Si, si cuando se habla de, de you, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. No sé si, si se puede referir a un grupo de personas o simplemente es una persona. Mm, yes, puede ser un grupo. Puede ser un puede grupo de personas. Pero hay que usarlo si nos estamos a, refiriendo a todos. A todos. Por ejemplo, mm -hmm. si yo digo, you look tired. No me refiero solo a ti, sino que puedo, puede ser para todos, ¿verdad? Me refiero a todos. Pero sí. si yo estoy hablando con alguien más, yo puedo decir they, porque no lo estoy incluyendo. Entonces sería que puede, puede utilizarse, ¿verdad? Pero tal vez en la oración no esté bien dicho. En la que me mencionabas. O Ajá. igual. Um, o sea que, que se, se puede utilizar referirse a varias personas, pero digamos, como se emplea, ¿verdad? Tal vez eh, se, se pueda, pueda ponerse incorrecto, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. y, y, y sería mejor poner there. Ajá, ajá, yes, correct. Oh, okay. Okay. ok, ok, guys. Well, we are going to check one more thing and then we will work in some conversations. Today you're going to create conversations in English. So that is the last thing that we will do to finish the week. Okay, so before, let me see. Um, let me ask. Can you tell me four, four occupations? Let's remember some occupations. Four occupations you remember, Nehemias. Uh, secretary, mm -hmm. uh, lawyer, mm -hmm. uh, engineer, mm -hmm. uh, uh, mechanic, mechanic. Mechanic, uh -huh. Yes, okay, thank you. Now, Adonai, other four occupations that you remember? Baker. Mm -hmm. For managers, policeman, fireman. Okay. Nurse. And nurse. Okay, that's very cool. Thank you. So here we have a little, a little test to refresh. Okay, Katia, tell me the English uh, form of the occupations, the first four occupations that you see. Mm. Uh, era actor, actress. And this one, number one. What is this occupation? La numero uno. Uh, writer, no, no, but no, okay. no <laughs> do you guys no, remember no this one? Who remembers the first occupation to help Katia? Just the first one, count, uh -huh. Account. an accountant. That's the one, Katia. Okay, number two, Actor and yes. actress. And actress. And the last one. Aquí me, me recuerdo que dijeron muchos, muchos, uh, muchas opciones. So what was this? Uh, yo creo que era arquitecto, pero no sé cómo se pronuncia. Uh -huh. No, no era eso. Architect. Ar That's the Architect. one. Yes. Okay, let's continue okay. with. Iris, okay, Iris, second line, five, six, seven, and eight. Can you tell us the occupations, please? Artist. Mm -hmm. Electric. 
Um, I don't have to. It's, uh, it's different. It's supposed to be a scientist. Number five, number time? six, a scientist, un científico. That is what it's supposed. Eso se supone que es. <laughs> but number seven, what is the occupation? Bakery. Baker. Uh huh. And this one? Baker. Um. Barber. A barber, yes. Okay, perfect. And then we continue with Doris. Okay, Doris. Fourth line. 9, 10, 11, and 12. Secretary. Mm -hmm. Or a bookkeeper could be. It could be another. But it could be a secretary. Uh -huh. And this one, number 10. Uh, constructor. A uh, builder. Uh -huh. I'm going to put it here. Uh, builder. Builder. Mm -hmm. uh, 11. <clears throat> Is a chauffeur, pero, um, you don't remember that one. Maybe your classmates can help you. Do you remember that one, guys? Number 11? Bus driver. Bus, bus bus driver. driver. Correct. That's the one, Doris. Bus driver. And number 12? Um, that is for, like, Camiones, uh -huh. the, the one you mentioned, but this one, yes, it's a bus driver. Okay, and the one here, Doris. You don't remember the English form. And you guys, have you checked your, your notes? Carnicera or carnicero in English? Who has that one? No one. Um, La divina. Freak, freak lady. Uh, it's, it's different. It's a butcher. 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 That's the one. Uh -huh. I'm going to send it in the chat if you, if you need. Butcher. The last one is R. La ultima era R. Butcher. Okay. Good. Let's go with the next line. Minette. Please help us with the next line. Okay. And here you have another option. Number 10, it says brick layer. Es, son como los que ponen los, estos, uh, el brick. Esos son brick layers. Okay, Minette, 13, 14, and 15. Eh, ay, no sé cómo se pronuncia carpintero. Car carpenter. 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 Mm -hmm. Carpenter. Um, cashier. Mm -hmm. Chef. And chef. Okay, great. So that is to refresh occupations. Okay, so now, now we are ready to create a role play. We're going to create a conversation and it's going to be in, in groups of three. I'm going to tell you right now the way it will work. You have to try to speak around one minute and a half. Traten de que su conversación dure alrededor de un minuto y medio. Y como son tres, son como 30 segundos cada uno, ¿verdad? Es bien poquito. Si pueden más, okay, so you can do it in a longer way. Now I'm going to give you the, the instruction, the way it's going to be. The conversation is going to be using, using your name. Uh, one moment. Okay. 
you can take this as a guide. This could be a guide for your conversation. Aquí tienen como un guía, una, una conversación modelo. Si ustedes quieren, pueden revisarla. It's on page number 12. Or you can take a screenshot if you want to, o le toman una captura de pantalla. And this is, this could be your model. Puede ser como el modelo de cómo empezarlo y luego ustedes la continúan, okay? So it's a conversation among three people. You can use your names and then you continue, okay? Va a ser una conversación, ahí pueden tener un modelo o lo pueden hacer como ustedes deseen más. Do you have a question about that activity? No? One minute, 30 seconds, ¿verdad? Traten de que la conversación dure un minuto y medio, at least. Okay, so please open the room. You're going to work with the same, the same group. And if you, if you need me, I'll go there and I'll visit you to help you out. Teacher, mm -hmm. which page is 12. the conversation? 12. Number 12, yes. Okay, thanks. Mm -hmm. You're welcome. Hagámosla, uh, hagámosla así. Primero voy a hablar. Hi. Is Hola. there something Hi. I can help you with? Uh. Not yet. Todavía no. No hayamos cómo armarla. Ajá, ya me imagino. Ok. Ok, entonces quizás vuelvo otro ratito. Les voy a dejar ahí que piensen un poquito en cómo van a ir. <laughs> Armándola. Ok, okay bye. All right, so I'll see you in, in a moment. Y si me necesitan cualquier cosa, pues ahí está el botón, ¿verdad? Y me llaman y yo pues les ayudo. Pero traten ahorita ustedes y si no, pues ya yo trato de, de ayudarles. Ok, see you okay. in a moment. Your occupation, Doris said. I coordinator. In you? I am a buyer. Where is uh, where is the work? And work in Liceo Cristiano. Okay. And you mean nice. And um, I work in Banco Promerica. And occupation business. Disney executive. Executive. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Uh, just one one reminder. Remember that here you're going to plan the conversation, and in the other room you're going to present the conversation. 
Okay. Acá la planean y allá ya la van a, a volver a dar. Okay. So remember. Ah, and, and mm. one comment. Minette, puedes decir my occupation is. My occupation okay. is. Ajá, para comenzarla ahí con eso. Ok, so do you need my help? Do you have some doubts? No. No, ok. No. Ahorita van bien, ¿verdad? Y veo que están tratando de ver cómo lo van a ir diciendo. Ok, all right. In that case, you, you can continue. I'm going to check another room. Bye. Hey, have a night. Y la sé. <laughs> Hi. How are you doing? ¿Qué tal vamos por acá? Ya llevan dos minutos de conversation. <laughs> ya todos tienen cara de cansaditos. Ya casi, ok. Ajá. Sí, es que siempre los viernes son como de los días ya como más pesados de la semana. So, ánimos. Ya casi, ok. Coffee, chocolate. Hay un chocolatito, un dulcito que les dé un poquito más de, de energy y ya luego ya, you can rest. Ok, mm -hmm. pero vamos bien por acá entonces. You don't need my help right now. ¿Todo? Mm, uh, ok, ok. Bueno, cualquier cosa, pues si me necesitan, you can let me know, ¿verdad? Venía por acá ahorita a ver si necesitaban ayuda, pero ahorita... Están bien, right? Estamos bien acá ahorita. ¿Sí? ¿Yes? ¿Adonai? ¿Yes? <laughs> ok. ¿O hay algo que les pueda ayudar? Is there something I can help you with? Eh, ¿Puedo ayudar en algo? Mm -hmm. Estamos yes. bien. Um, pues no he oído la conversación. Ajá, I don't know. Ah, es que va a tener sorpresa. Ah, ah, ok. All right. Well, in that case, you, you can continue, guys. I'm going to visit another room. Ok. So, okay. how long do you think it will take you? ¿En cuánto tiempo creen que estén ready? Son las 9.31, 9.31. Four minutes. Yes, yes, five minutes. minutes. Okay, all right, continue then. Hi. Hi. Hey. Hi. <laughs> How are you doing? Have you Hi. finished the conversation? <laughs> In <laughs> terms of the conversation. <laughs> okay, and how long and más o menos hecho la cuenta de cuánto le sale de tiempo? No. No. Not yet. No, oh. no tomamos. No hicimos no, el no. conteo. Ah, ok. No. So you already finished. Ya la tienen. Yo eh. No. <risa> no, ni yo. No anoté tampoco. Era, Era de escribirla. <risa> well, you're going to present the conversation in the, other, in the other room. La idea es que acá la prepararan para tenerla y darla en el otro room. Todos la, la oh, van a dar. Ajá. Ah, oh, ok. Well, okay. if you have it here, that's fine. Si la tienen en, en mente, it's ok. Ajá. But yes, try to remember that it's about one minute and 30 seconds. One minute, 30 seconds. Okay. Yo llevo el tiempo y si no, improvisamos. Ok, you improvise, you continue. So try to imagine okay. what you could say. Uh -huh. Traten de ver qué es lo que podrían decir. At 9.35, we will get back to the main room. In two minutes. In two minutes, we will go back to the other room. Okay. Okay, so see you in, in okay. a moment, guys.
Hi, Minette. Welcome. You finish. Uh, no, porque es que tenemos problemitas con Iris, que really? su internet está, está bastante mal porque se sale, no se le escucha. Ah. Entonces no, no llegamos a un acuerdo. Ah, ok. Well, try to improvise in that case, ok? Don't worry. Try to improvise. Go with the flow. Ok. Ajá. Ok, no okay. problem. But I understand. Ok, is there a volunteer who would like to go first? ¿Hay algún voluntario, grupo voluntario? To start. ¿Quién dijo yo? Who? No one. Ok. Ok, well, in that case, um, Jenny, Jenny, Adonai, and Mario, let's, let's start with you. But give me one second. We're going to prepare the, the, the room. And we're missing Mario. Okay, okay, Mario, I can put you here on the spotlight, but you you will show show up in a moment. Okay, you can start. You can start now. Just remember to activate the microphones. Hello. I am Mario. What your name? Hello, Mario. I am Jose. My name is Marcela. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. How are you? I am very good. I am fine. We are yeah. classmates. Saludcito. That's it. That's it. No more. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Well then. Thank you. We are busy in like like 40 seconds. Um, can you try to improvise? Is there something else you could add? Um, why don't you talk about uh -huh, why don't you talk about your occupations? Bye. Bye. Nos quedamos en we are classmates. Uh -huh. Yes. Bye. Um, what is the what is your occupation? Mm -hmm. Boys. Mm -hmm. I am a uh, uh, system development, development system. Mm -hmm. I am tire supervisor. And you, Jennifer? Oh, really? I I am cashier at Banco Promerica. Uh -huh. Okay, so now try to say goodbye. Try to... Uh, say goodbye. Traten de despedirse in English. What would you say? Ideas. Okay, very good. Uh, where are you from? Adonai and Jennifer. Yes, I am from Mexico. Wow. And you? <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> Is that true? You're from Mexico. I, I'm yeah. from Japan. Ja Japan? Mm. Japan? Yes, Japan. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> um, I have to go. I have, I have to go. go. to see you and, and good night. Uh -huh. See you. See you tomorrow. Okay. See you, See you on Monday. See you on Monday. 
Okay, very good. Okay, and applause to all of you. Thank you for your effort. I know it's kind of difficult, but you made it. Okay, so, so thank you. Now we will, let me uh, put it here in the right way. Okay, Adonai. I'm going to remove you from the spotlight. I think it's, it's done. Now, Adonai, who will go next? Help me choose. Ayúdame a escoger, Adonai. Who, who will go next? Oh, the microphone. I, I don't hear you. Nehemiah and his group. Okay, so Nehemiah, Mirna, and Vladimir. Okay, I'm going to add you here on the spotlight. And Mirna, here it is. And Nehemiah is, is there on the back. Okay, you can, you can start. Hi. Hi. Hello. Hello. Yeah. Hello. Hello. I am Nehemiah. Uh, and Vladimir uh, and Mirna. My group and uh, study English and practice one conversation. And tell me, what city do you live? Mirna, and yes. What? City what? do you live? Where are you, where are you from? My from is La Libertad. Okay, and you, Demis? I am from in La Libertad. I live in Ciudad Arce. Okay. I live in and, the and, and you, Vladimir? Um, San Salvador, Mexicanos. Mexicanos. Yes, and tell me, um, what, what all are you? I am 37 years old. Well, you have what? reached the time. What? If, okay. Do you have okay. more or do you want to? Okay, what, what is your favorite hobby? Ah, my favorite oh. color is, is blue. And mirror? Our color is um, uh, violet. Okay. Um, Are you single or married? I'm married. I'm, Ma me too. I'm married. I'm married. Yes. Oh, do you do you have any children? Not. I not. I am not. And, and you, Mirna? Two children. Two children. Okay. Hey, what is your is... favorite music? Uh, okay. Two children. Okay. Two children. What is your favorite music? Uh, my favorite music is a ska, rock, metal. I sing every. My favorite you, is tropical music. And you, Mirna? I, I, not, not music favorite. Not, not favorite. Mm -hmm. Okay. Are you like the pets? Uh, I cat. Are you like the cats? And you, Vladimir? Um, I have uh, two dogs and one cat. Okay. Uh, yes. I, I have to go. I see you later. See you. Nice to meet you. 
Okay, thank you very much. Wow, that was a long conversation. Thank you, thank you. I'm going to remove you from the spotlight, but thank you very much. It was like three minutes, three minutes and 30 seconds. So you did it more, more than that. I have some comments, but I will, I will have, well, I will tell you when we finish, okay, at the end. But in this moment, we will continue with Doris, Doris, Minette, and Iris. Okay, I know that you had some, some problems to do it, so do your best, okay? Yo sé que me comentaron que tuvieron problemas de, de connection, así que... Sí, ya me di cuenta. Que conversan Doris y Mile. Y yo, y yo al final que estás hago una pequeña conversación sola, con, con, no sé cómo sea, pero quizás ellas que hagan lo que practicaron. Y yo al final me uno. No, mire, ah, así no, no. compañeros que iban pre... Yo me imagino que se iban acordando de las, de las cosas para preguntar. Ajá, just a little bit. Yes, okay. try to use the verb. Con el verb, que es lo que hemos estado estudiando. Okay, something short. Don't okay. worry. Mm -hmm. Okay, go. Hi. I am Doris. Nice to Hi. meet you. Hi, Doris. Hi, Doris. Nice to meet you. Uh, my name is Mineta. And My name you? is Joanna. I live in San Salvador, and you? I, I live in, in Corinto, Morazan. Wow. I live in, in San Salvador. Great. Uh, what your uh, occupation uh, it is? My occupation is scientific. Wow, wow, excellent. And Doris? My occupation is coordinator. Se me está descargando el teléfono. And my... And you? Uh, and my occupation uh, is a business... Uh, Ay, esa palabra. Executive. Es... Executive. Ay, no. no es mi amiga esa palabra. Executive. <laughs> Don't worry. Ok. Uh, you well. have children. You have children. Eh, children. No. I. 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 Two. Hijos, ¿cómo se? Son. Son. Ajá. Uh -huh. Two sons. I do song. Eh, eh, one bo, um, boys mm -hmm. and one girl. Ah, oh, two children in that case. Uh -huh. Okay, well, that's good. I'm going to stop you there, but very good improvising. You did it very, very well. So thank you, Iris, Doris, and Minette. I, mm -hmm. I appreciate it. So if you want to do this, you can go and, and charge your phone. Si quiere, póngalo a cargar para que le aguante los últimos minutitos. Sí, el, el teléfono. Puse. Ah, OK. Por eso iba oh, moviéndose. Mister. OK. Yes. Miss, eh, quería uh -huh. comentarle que me voy a retirar unos minutos antes porque tengo una emergencia y tengo que llevar a alguien ah, okay. a trasladarlo a otro, a otro pueblito de acá. Ok, Minette. Entonces Minet. me voy a retirar un poquito antes. Ok, Minet, I understand. Have a good night and remember the homework. Ok, guys, because today is the last day to do it. Eh, la tarea, Minet, no, no. Ya, olvides. ya la, ya la ah, hice. Bye. Ok, sí, luego de la clase voy a, a chequear. Sí. Ok, Minet, bye. have a nice weekend. See you on Monday. Bye. Thank you. Hmm? Thank, Thank you. Me. Good night. Good night. Good night. Okay, then we have Anna, Katia, and Marisela. They are the last ones. Yes, Doris, do you have a comment? I quiero decir algo. Uh -huh. Tell us. <laughs> aparte, a, aparte de, mi, de mis children, uh -huh. I am, I, I, 
have, yo tengo, I have. No. Uh -huh. I don't hear you. No se oye nada ahorita. Something happened. I think she lost the connection. Nos dejó con la intriga de qué iba a decir. <laughs> okay, Doris, I hear you again. Qué temilla. <laughs> que le escribe <laughs> entonces. <laughs> Queremos saber. <laughs> ya nos dejó picado. Ajá, yo tengo, and then, no. Nothing. Ok, yo creo que lo va a mandar Mañana en el chat. le preguntamos. Sí, ahí en el grupo vamos a preguntar. So, Ana, Katia, and Marisela. Ok, let's listen to you. Ok. Uh, hi, Marisela. This is my friend, Ana. Hi, Katia. Uh, nice to meet you, Ana. Uh, she is... Hi, Marisela. Okay. She is in our English class. Ah, okay. Excellent. In this company, perfect. Uh, what is your occupation? Uh, Anna is nurse. Okay. I do. I am his assistant. Um, you, Katia? Uh, I am assistant. Um, do you like uh, studying English? Mm -hmm. Anna? <laughs> uh, and you, well, Marisela, uh, do you like studying English? Yes, I like to the English. I have the teacher very good. <laughs> okay. Um, Sorry. <laughs> yes. uh, uh, um, where did you live? Uh, I can hear you, Marisela. You could repeat the question. Mm -hmm. Uh, Indiana, where do you live? No sé qué dice. Okay, uh, all right. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> I think that I will I will stop you there, but thank you. Thank you very much, Katia, Ana, and, and Maricela. Okay, thank you for, for your effort. Thank you to all of you. I know it's difficult. It's difficult to make a conversation, but little by little, you're going to be better. Okay, you're going to- Sorry, improve. teacher. No, it's okay, it's okay. We will practice. Uh, just three comments. This is the question about the age. How old are you? This is the question in English. How old are you? And the pronunciation of this word, OQ, occupation. That is the correct way to say it, occupation. The question is, what is your occupation? And remember, we have to say, I am or am a, and then you mention, the occupation, I am a teacher. Okay, so remember these three, three comments about it. Okay, last thing before we go. I'm going to tell you three things about me. I'm going to tell you three things about me.
Okay. So here you have three sentences about me, about myself. There is one lie. Two sentences are true, but there is one sentence that is false. Hay una mentira en esos tres comentarios. I'm 29. I have two siblings. Siblings, yes, no sé siblings. Si hermanos, pero de ambos sexos. Okay. Porque ah. solo brothers son hombres. Siblings. Uh -huh. okay. siblings son hermanos, hermanas. And I do exercise. Which do you think it's the lie? Which do you think it's the lie? ¿Cuál creen que sea la mentira? Let's vote. Katia, I, I'm 29. No, I have three siblings that I do exercise. Okay, Your so this is the one. Then Vladimir, you say that Your my age. age. Okay, Anna and you, which is the lie? ¿Cuál ¿En cuál cree que estoy mintiendo? I'm 29, I have two siblings, I do exercise. The number two. You say number two, I have two siblings. Jenny, the first one. Anna, ¿cuál cree que sea la mentira? Este... En la, en la primera, pero no sé cómo decir. The first, the first the one. First, the okay. first. Okay, and you, Mirna? The first. The first one, too. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, yo creo que les dije. I, I think I told you, right? Doris, and you? And the first. The first one. Okay, how old am I? How old am I? Do you remember? 28. 28. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Correct. I'm 28. So, yes, that's the lie. I do have two siblings and I do exercise once or twice a month, but I do it. Como dos veces al mes, pero, pero hago, ¿eh? peor es nada. Okay, so good job. Eh, Doris, we read the message. Logramos leer el mensaje. Finalmente. Uh -huh. <laughs> you are a I grandmother. Have, uh, I have children. ¿verdad? Grandchildren. Nietos, grand grandchildren. Children. Wow. One. one. <laughs> okay. How old? How old is your yeah. grand, your granddaughter eh, or grandson? El próximo mes cumple un año. Ah, okay. It's a little baby in this moment. Okay, mm -hmm. sounds cool, Doris. So, yeah. okay, before we go, I'm going to take the attendance really quick. Okay, so we have Alexander, no, Anna, Doris. Okay, Doris, thank you. Iris. Present. Jenny, Jennifer, Present. Adonai. Okay, thank you. Present. Jose Angel Castro, Mario, Present. Katia. Present. Manuel, Ángela, María Mejía, Marisela. Present. Silvio, okay. Mirna. Present. Inet, se marchó. Ok. Nehemías. Nelson. Present. Thank you. Vladimir. And ok. Thank you. So, let me check. Um, where we go? Okay. It is, is it possible for you to stay today for the session, the 10 minute session? Puedes quedar yes, la sesión? Ah, okay. Yes. So I'm going to stay with you. So guys, enjoy the weekend. Have a nice weekend. Rest, descansen mucho. See you next week. Take care. Bye-bye, everyone. Thank you. Bye. 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 Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye. Bye-bye, everyone. Sweet dreams. Okay, it is. Hi, how are you? I'm fine. 
You're fine. Very You're very? Yes, I'm very. Ah, okay. You're very well. Okay. Very well. And you are not tired. No estás muy cansada. No, no. I am vacation. Ah, okay. That's cool. <laughs> Yes, okay. Days. Ah, okay, that's nice. When do you go back? Hasta um, 20, 20, no, 19, uh, ju July, July, 19. July, 19. Ah, okay, so you still have 10 days, 10 days more. Yes. You started the vacation this week, on Monday. On Monday. Ah, okay, that's cool. So it is, here you have a, a, a session. I don't know if there is something you would like to practice or to reinforce with me. Quizás una duda que, que me quedó de, de los... De los... Pero ver, ¿puedes decir nouns de ayer? Uh -huh. Ajá. Pues me mencionaba algo que los andaba buscando por aquí, que los inanimados no, ah. no son usados. Ah, con, sí, con, con possessive nouns. Ajá. Sí, como cuando algo tiene vida o para animales, tenemos la S, ¿verdad? Que si yo quiero decir que algo es mío, uh -huh. yo puedo decir Evelyn car is nice, ¿verdad? Porque aquí hago la, la... Con esto doy a entender que hay una posesión, pero cuando hay algo inanimado, no se trabaja así, sino que se hace normal. Por ejemplo, digamos que tenemos owner... Eh, Imagine this, colegio más ferrer. Ok, and the possession, it could be maybe students. Ok, aquí está el, el dueño, ¿verdad? Y la posesión, los estudiantes de este lugar. Como es algo inanimado, se pondría primero la posesión y luego se pondría el lugar. The students of colegio más ferrer are happy. Entonces no hay ningún cambio. Entonces, uh -huh. Can you give me an example? For example, if you talk about the battery, talk about this. We have, give me a one, one moment. Imagine that you have this. The owner will be a cell phone. And you want to talk about the battery. Can you try to make a sentence showing possession? Telling us something about the battery. Uh, Carlos cell phone. But don't mention a person because right now the owner is the cell phone. Ahorita el dueño es el teléfono. Oh, okay. No una no una persona. Mm -hmm. The cell phone is of battery, no. Pero tienes que decir algo sobre la batería. Así como el anterior. O te daré otro ejemplo para que luego puedas crear uno. Ok. The battery of the cell phone is low. Bajas. Y aquí estoy hablando, hay una posición, porque yo estoy hablando de la batería y la posición del teléfono. Ajá. 
Uh, Just, y eh. ya luego continúo la idea. Can you try? Mm -hmm. Can you try to give me examples? Okay. Um, siempre con, el, con este dueño y, y en la misma posición o lo puedo cambiar? Ajá, uh, uh -huh, change it. Si tienes otra, otra cosa en mente, puedes utilizar otra cosa. Uh -huh. eh, the table... The table of my house... Uh -huh. is, uh, is small. Uh -huh. Correct. Entonces sería así la manera. Al contrario de que cuando hablamos de algo que tiene vida, no se dice así, sino que ya sería, por ejemplo, it is, it is, imagine this, it is table is small. Porque ya estoy incluyéndote a ti, ¿verdad? Ya es una persona la, la dueña. Pero con, en el caso de la casa, que estamos hablando de una casa y de una mesa, entonces sí. Uh -huh. The table of the, of the house is small. Pero acá no. Okay. Es que acá yo quizás, ajá, yo quizás me, había, me había confundido por un ejemplo que vimos. Uh, did you read yesterday's newspaper? Ah, yo pensé que no se podía. Ajá. Con time ¿Sabes? words sí se puede. Con, con palabras de tiempo podríamos hacer eso. Como que dijera esto. Ah, ok. Ajá. Digamos que tenemos today, que significa hoy, ¿verdad? Y la posesión sería class. Or maybe we can say yesterday, es otra palabra de tiempo. Yesterday. Y la possession, digamos, que sería weather, clima. Ahora, yo quiero hablar de esto, de esto. Yo podría decir, today's apostrophe es class was about possessives. Was es el, el pasado del verb be, ¿verdad? El pasado. O podría ser is, si tú quieres, para no confundir. Today's class is about possessives. Okay, entonces yo estoy hablando de, no sé si entiendes acá lo, lo que estoy diciendo. Sí, que sí. ayer se habló sobre los posesivos. Ahora se habló ah, ahora que, que la clase. Uh -huh, correcto. Y lo mismo puedo hacer con, si quiero hablar del clima. ¿Pero de quién? Tendría que ser de una palabra de tiempo, ¿verdad? Entonces yo puedo decir, mm. yesterday was weather, food, TV show. Pueden haber muchas cosas. But yesterday's weather was hot. Yesterday, the weather. Entonces, con time words se puede hacer también. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. Así que eso se puede. Okay. Y también de que a veces no ex, expando mucho porque hay algunas, como las clases van con niveles, ¿verdad? Y ahorita vamos en básico, entonces son como las bases o el fundamento. Cuando uno ya va avanzando en, en, las, en las fases o en los niveles, ya se le va dando un poquito de dificultad en los temas, ¿verdad? Pero, ajá, ajá. así funciona con Time Works. Ok, sí, es que no había visto quizás eh, esos ajá. ejemplos en, en tiempo. Pero ah. lo vi, me parece extraño. Ajá. Creo que no se podía utilizar en llamados. Ajá, ajá. porque... Ajá. Realmente ahora vi el ejemplo, ajá. Ah, ok, but good question. Sí, sí, es, fue algo bueno, igual que la pregunta de Doris, porque no había mencionado cosas inanimadas y ella dijo, pero ¿cómo es con las cosas inanimadas? So it's a good question. Uh -huh. too. Yeah. No siempre, yo a veces salto algunas cositas, pero por eso, ¿verdad? Para no confundirlos, 
o empaparlos mucho, sino que vayamos poco a poco. Ok, Iris, okay. I guess that's going to be all. Is there something else you, you may need before we go? ¿Algo más antes que nos vayamos? No, teacher. No, no. esa era la duda que tenía. Sí, ok. Muchas gracias. A pleasure, Iris. Take care. See you on Monday. Bye bye. See you on Monday. Bye, See teacher. You. Thank you.